What's up, big birds? Let's take a look at the bone microanatomy, and we're going to do so using human anatomy VR from virtual medicine. And if we take a look, this is sort of a cross section through the bone. So we can see out here we have the periosteum, and this is going to be the connective tissue layer surrounding the bone. So we can go ahead and we can just pull off that periosteum. And then here we're going to have the compact bone. So we'll move that up. And we'll sort of walk in and zoom in on that a little bit. And we can see here the compact bone is made up of these osteons. And these osteons, right, are made up of concentric lamellae. So that's what each one of these individual, like, rings is, right? So those are concentric lamellae. Now, the osteons, if we look, are these little circles. But surrounding the inner circles or filling them are the interstitial lamellae. And then out here around the outside, you're going to see the circumferential lamellae that go along on the outside, right? So and if this is a cross-section of bone and we can see our compact bone here, there's our osteons, we can see that the canals run uh, parallel to these osteons. These are going to be our herversion canals or what some people refer to as central canals. And then connecting those canals are these perforating canals or what some people will refer to as Volkmann's canals. Okay, so you have your compact bone superficially, and then you have your cancellous bone deeply that's going to be surrounded by the endosteum. So we'll remove that endosteum, and we can see that spongy bone or that cancellous bone deep to the compact bone. Now, if this is a cross-section through a long bone, we also know that the long bone has a medullary cavity, and that cavity is going to be filled with our yellow marrow. So we can take our yellow marrow, we can put it there. We have our cancellous bone or our spongy bone that is going to be surrounded by the endosteum. And then we have our compact bone made of osteons that is going to be surrounded by the periosteum. And that is what bone tissue looks like. Now you know. Later.